Alright everyone and welcome in Happy Wild Card Wednesday Ladies and gentlemen today We're going to start a new gauntlet uh, We have played it once before But we're actually going to begin our grind on Enter the 36 Chambers By CJ1987 How are y'all doing today Let's take a brief moment To welcome everyone in Coming in first we got Stephanie Lisser dropping that like Saying hi redhead how are you doing today Steph thank you for that like so much My friend how are you doing today Read it Messrs. Mooney, Wormtail, Padfoot, and Prongs offer their compliments to Professor Snape and... Go on. ...and request that he keep his abnormally large nose out of other people's business. Let's go. Second like on the stream, Lauren Wonder. Welcome in, babe. How are you doing today? Thank you so much for the like, my love. Hi, Puddin. Miss me? Well, hello, beautiful. And you are beautiful. Let's go. Let's get a third like on the stream. Coming in with a like and a share. That is Shonda. Welcome in, my friend. How are you doing today, Shonda? Thank you so much for that like. Let's go. Let's go. How is everybody doing today? How is your Wednesday, folks? We're going to begin 36 Chambers. Enter the 36 Chambers by CJ1987. The game of chess is like a sword fight. You must think first before you move. For Justin Sells. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's hop right on in. We got a long grind ahead of us to beat this masterpiece. Only two people have done it so far. Captain OP being one of them. Um, I'm not sure who the other one, oh, Justin Sells was the other one, the dedicated level to Justin Sells. He beat the level first, then the captain beat it, and Professor Sport Mode is currently working on it, and so am I. Let's get it, let's go. <laughs> let's see if we can remember the dance. Let's see if we can remember this dance. Alright, bad hop there. That's alright. Out of chamber one, into chamber two. Uh, Shonda said, I'm doing alright. Pretty sure I'm getting sick and my daughter just got over being sick and now I'm getting... Yikes, that's not good. Trying to stay positive. Let's go. Stay positive, my friend. Hopefully you don't get sick. And if you do, hopefully uh, it passes very quick. And Lauren said, eating soup. It's so good. Let's go. Screen frozen. Okay. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank y'all for letting me know that. Uh, ba -da -ba 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 -ba. ba da boom ba da bang There we go. That should work. Game screen not showing. Yeah. Capture card just froze on me. It happens from time to time, folks. Sorry about that. Uh, and welcome in, Captain. How are you doing today? Brian Simmons. What's going on, brother? What's going on? That is Captain BS right here on Facebook, guys. The second clear on R&B Encore. Only two minutes away from the clear, the first clear. Super close battle between you two guys. GG's on that, Captain. How are you doing today? Yep, thank y'all for letting me know uh, about the game screen. Capture card does freeze from time to time. Uh, Shana said the positive note is that since I'm nursing, the baby will get antibody. So that's good. That is very true. And we got Zachary Singleton, Dr. Z coming in, dropping the like. What's going on, brother? How are you? Thank you so much for the like. He said, good evening, everyone. Redhead brother, how are you doing? I'm doing good, my friend. Uh, my alerts just don't want to play for some reason. My alerts just don't want to play. I can still play them manually, though. I can still play them manually. Let's go, let's get it, let's go, let's go. We got Miss Lady Joe coming in, dropping the heart reacts. Welcome in, Jojo. How are you doing, darling? Thank you for the like. Pose, pose, pose. Pose, pose, pose. I'm doing good, Mr. Singleton. How are you doing? And we're getting a painless streamer raid, guys. Can we get an exclamation raid in that chat? Let's welcome in the painless streamer and raiders. What's going on, everybody? Thank y'all so much for coming over on that raid with Mr. Pain. How are you? How are you? Somebody drop that exclamation raid for me while we wait on everybody to get in here. Let's go. There it comes. And 
and there he is there's the man himself the painless streamer with a me raid what's going on brother how did turtles go how far did you get my friend thank you so much for the raid much 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 love my friend we're gonna celebrate that raid real quick guys the proper way and now that everyone is in here thank you all so much for the raid again mr pain and everyone who came with him this one is for you Let's go. Welcome in, Raiders. Thank you all for the exclamation raid, everybody. Zachary Singleton said, I'm doing good. Glad to hear it, brother. Glad to hear it. Mr. Payne dropping the double, the like, and the raid. Coming in with the quadruple threat. Welcome in, sir. Thank you so much for that love. Payne has a face. Allow me to show it to you. Gentlemen. I. Ah, pain. He said, got to 14 and now my tush hurts. Yikes, sir. Yikes. All right, so I got to figure out the dance with those tornadoes here. Got to figure out the dance with those tornadoes. I've got a good point of reference for that. Okay, so that's kind of what we need to do there. Uh, welcome in V and Evelyn. How are y'all doing today? Thank y'all so much for those likes. That's mystic underscore Eve underscore gaming over on the purple side. How are you doing mystic? I got you. And we got Penguin in here as well. Welcome in, Penguin Gaming. How are you doing today, darling? Thank you for the like. Finally, the fish are jammed into a styrofoam box, which helps insulate their screams of terror. But don't tell the Science Channel or they'll cut our funding again. Let's go. Let's get it. How are y'all doing today, everybody? Welcome in. Thank y'all so much for the likes. Hopefully you had a great Wednesday. Uh, v said, Redhead just got home eating and taking a short nap. Let's go. That sounds like a great way to spend the evening. Um, Zach said, Hope all are doing well today and thanks for dropping in. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you, Mr. Payne. All right, we got to figure this little dance out. We've done it once before. We've done it once before. I just got to figure out the timing again. So this is Enter the 36 Chambers by CJ1987. Uh, we have played this a little bit once before. Not very far into the level though we've only gotten past that um that piranha plant section once or twice so we have quite the grind ahead of us quite the grind ahead of us all right let's go let's get it all right so we got a spin jump to here Oh, wow. Right into a fireball. Yikes, my guy. Yikes. That's no good. Okay. That's not quite the timing, then. That's not quite the timing. It worked. It got me across, but right into a fireball. That's not good. Yeah, so how is everybody's Wednesday treating them? Are you super excited for the weekend? Are you ready for Christmas, folks? I know I've been asking that like every day, but we are there. We are there. It is Christmas, basically. 
We got Cameron coming in saying, hey, Mr. Redhead, what's going on, Mr. Moxon Gaming? How are you doing today, sir? What's up, what's up? How are you, brother? Thank you so much for the like. Uh, fun fact, guys, Moxon Gaming is an Xbox-only player. He only plays Xbox. <laughs> He does not like PlayStation at all. Not a fan at all of PlayStation. That's what he told me. Words from his mouth. Words from his mouth, folks. Pretty good. I'm doing good, my man. I'm doing good. Cannot complain at all. Uh, I was a little bit cold today. A little Got a little bit wet again today. But you know, we, we in here. We doing the thing. We doing the thing. We're going to survive. We're going to keep doing what we do best. And that is be terrible at Mario. Oh, bad timing. Bad timing. Uh, Cam said, I am. Listen to everything this streamer tells you because he only speaks truth. That's exactly what he said. You guys can see it right there. Right there. <laughs> That's exactly what he said. 100%. <laughs> How are you doing today, brother? Much, much love. We like to we like to pick with each other a little bit. He, uh, he told me he only likes PlayStation. And so, um... I'm going to talk him into getting an Xbox, folks. We're going to do it. We're going to do it. He's going to break and he's going to get an Xbox. He just doesn't know it yet. He just don't know it yet. That way we can crush some zombies together. Oof, not good. That made me laugh so hard. <laughs> As I said, one thing I have to say is either way I would be playing these games. So it's awesome. Y'all jump in. Yeah, buddy. Let's go. Let's go. I feel the same. I'll still be playing the games regardless of who I get to play with. I'll be playing them. Uh, I don't think so. Oh, absolutely. It's gonna happen, sir. It's gonna happen. Zach and I were playing zombies the other day. Just saying. Just saying, Cam. Just saying. Zach and I were playing zombies. You know. Because we had the superior console. So we were able to play together. <laughs> oh, no. He says, I love zombies. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, buddy. We were playing uh, Black Ops 4. Playing the map 9 or IX, whatever you want to call it. I call it 9. Roman numeral 9. And, um, yeah. Yeah, having a lot of fun with that. Even V wants to get an Xbox so she can come play with us. See, if both of y'all just get Xboxes, then we can all four play together. That's how it works, right? Oh, so close. This is dangerous territory I'm in right now, folks. Dangerous territory. Now, I gotta figure this out. Think I wanna hit it on the way down. Oh, that was close. That was close. That was very, very close. Uh, that console is poop box. PlayStation is better. See the lies that these people come and spread in my chat. Y'all see this? <laughs> Don't feel bad though because I spread the same type of lies in their chat. Only my lies are backed by facts. The facts are that I own the console that I promote. <laughs> That's the only facts that uh, uh, back my speech. Uh, she said it's the better console. Exactly. I remember. I remember it. I remember her saying that. I remember her saying that 100%. Oh, man. Okay. Okay. Well, that's progress. We got the key coin. Sorry, you're with Cam. I mean, it could be Black Ops Sunday if everybody had an Xbox with Black Ops on. I'm just saying, you know, it could. They just need to make it cross-platform at this point. They need to make it cross-platform at this point because it's so old that nobody plays it anymore. So they're like, yeah. 
Rusty Shackleford coming in, dropping that like. What's up, brother? How are we doing today, Rusty? Thank you for the like and thank you for the progress. Much, much love. Whoever did it. Who did it? JoJo did it. Thank you for the progress, JoJo. Da, 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 da. Oh, man. I'm in so much trouble with this level. Y'all have no idea. Oh, I was close. I was close. I want to bounce off of him and come back, but I don't think that's the play. I don't think that's actually the play. I think what I need to do is just wait on the Prana Plant to start going down. And avoid the uh, spikes. Just jump up there, grab the coin, and avoid the spikes. I think that's the real play. I'll read that in just a one moment. Uh, we all have a switch. Yes, we do. It should be cross-platform. Absolutely. Let's compromise. Let's just go with just go with the switch, sir. Um, do they have it on the switch? I didn't think it was even on the switch. Didn't think it was even on the switch. So then it'd be settled on which is better. That's very true. The left hand of the screen looks great. Hey, yo. Thank you for that, JoJo. And Bo Nystrom coming in, dropping the heart react. Welcome in, Bo. How are you doing today, brother? Thank you for that heart. We do. Yeah, we all have a Switch. But is that game on the Switch? That's the real question. And then I have to rebuy it. Y'all are trying to make me rebuy a game that I already own? Yuck. Who does that? <laughs> Who does that? So for those of you just joining, we have entered the 36 chambers. This is a level by CJ1987, I believe, is the numbers. And it is a gauntlet grind. It's like saying, Bo, 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 Bo. We don't have to play that. I mean, we do. Now, we all have a Switch. We can play something, but... Question is, what game do we all have that we can all play and agree is a good game? Is Mario Kart is not a good game in my opinion. Just saying, just gonna throw that out there. Just gonna throw that one out there. Uh -huh. Unpopular opinion. Mario Kart's a bad game. <coughs> <laughs> all right, let's get it. Bad timing. Uh, Bo said, good today, good tomorrow, rest of the week, not so much. Stressing it. I believe it, brother. Y'all be safe up there. With all that uh, snow coming in, all them storms. No Mario Kart. Pokemon. Yeah, I mean, Pokemon, you know. But there's not really much to do on Pokemon together. Just raid, pretty much, and battle each other. That's really all there is to do as far as playing together. Cart's only good for like an hour. Yeah. It was only good for like the first hour that I bought it. You're right. <laughs> I'll agree with that. Only good for like the first hour that I bought it. Oh, that was close. I should have did a bigger jump. Okay. We can, but we know Xbox is better. You're right, V. Xbox is better. We know that. You're absolutely right. Xbox is 100% better. Be careful. We're getting two to three inches in the blizzard. I mean, two to three inches ain't bad. John was talking about they're going to be getting one to two feet. But two to three inches ain't going to be too bad in comparison. It's still going to be a lot. Don't get me wrong. It's more than I'll ever see in my life, probably. Ugh, bonked. Uh, 60 mile an hour winds, 3 to 5 inches again. Middle of the lake is supposed to get 20 plus foot waves. Woo! That's going to be crazy. That's going to be crazy. Not much snow, but be good as long as we uh, don't lose power. We got 60 plus mile an hour wind gusts up here uh, on the lake, and I'm all electric, so keep that going, and I'm good. There you go. There you go. Hopefully, uh, Hopefully, it will stay on for you guys. 
Alright, let's get some progress, guys. I want to get to the fourth room. I want to get to the fourth chamber. I need to get to the fourth chamber. Did they change autocorrect Xbox or rename it? They must have... Yeah, they, they must have... Uh, they must have their Xbox to uh, be preset and to autocorrect as PlayStation. That's what it is. I know V. She typed Xbox 100%. It might be Facebook. It might be a Facebook thing. Facebook might have accidentally uh, misread Xbox's PlayStation and put PlayStation in there. Because you know how Facebook likes to change all the facts. <laughs> we all know how Facebook loves to change the facts. People own PlayStation since 1 or 2? I thought they went out of business. I mean, yeah, see, there you go. There you go. They might as well have. They might as well have. <laughs> I keep watching Cam uh, Moxon gaming. He's playing on his PlayStation, but he's playing Sega games. And every time I go in there, I talk about how awesome the PlayStation graphics are. That they're so realistic. <laughs> they're always like, this is a Sega game. I'm like, but you're playing PlayStation. So realistic. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that was close. That was close. I almost got it. I almost got it. I almost got it, guys. This is going to be a tough level. That little jump right there is going to be extremely difficult to get down pat. Don't be jealous. <laughs> Ain't nobody jealous in here, sir. Nobody except me. Oh, you were talking about me. <laughs> you were talking about me. Uh, well, no promises. No promises. No promises. I'd be jealous if I won't. Yikes, okay, I need him to spit that fireball high, so I need to be high bouncing. The trolls between good friends. Ah, yes, ah, yes. Uh, v said, see, I told y'all Red was picking today and causing trouble. Yes, absolutely, 100% all day. That is what I do. Uh, v said, I like cart, but can't do it for a long time. Yep, yep, yep. Same here, same here. Same here. I was a Sony fanboy growing up. Then my dad bought me the OG Xbox and played Halo with him for months. That's the moment my fandom died. Let's go. That's the moment you realized that there is a better option. You see, Cam? If you just make the switch one time, it's over. You never go back. <laughs> You'll never go back. Dum dum bow wow 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 Alright, let's get past this man. I'm tired of seeing these same four rooms, three rooms, whatever they are. I need to see something new. We need more content, folks. We need more content. Uh I didn't die. Wait, what? It didn't die. It was corrected. Yeah, there you go. There you go. <laughs> we got 8092 coming in, dropping the heart reaction. What's going on, brother? How are you doing today, 80? Thank you for that heart. Much, much love. Guys, if y'all haven't checked out 80 yet, what are you doing? Why haven't you checked him out yet? Oof. All right. Just take my time here, and we can get past this. Oh, man. So close. Why is that so hard? You switch first. No, see, I've already had PlayStations. I've already had PlayStations. I already made my switch. I made switch from the PlayStation to the Xbox. And it was worthwhile. Man, that is so rough. Um, Cam said, I'm good. Nah. <laughs> I'm good. Nah. <laughs> I'll stick with what I know. I'll stick with what I know. 
Lauren said, I had a PS1 and 2, then got the Xbox 360 because my dad wanted one, and that was the end of owning a PlayStation. And, uh, Zach said, Dido. Dido. Don't know what Dido has to do with any of this. She's a musician or vocalist. I don't know what Dido has to do with Xbox and PlayStation, but. Okay, Dido. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what that noise was in the background, but something went rolling around and banging around in there. Oh, we got room one down. Room two is pretty much down as long as we get the right cycle. Or chamber two, rather. That would be chamber two, in my opinion. This would be chamber three. I'm counting this as three. Even though it's technically the same chamber. Okay, now we just gotta get back. Oh no! <laughs> I didn't do it! Ditto! Oh, ditto. That's the only switch I'll make. What switch? He means same. Ditto. Yep. D-I-T-T-O. Wrong love. <laughs> it's ditto leave him alone it's ditto it's a pokemon uh v said my ps4 is wonderful eventually a five i'm not sure about that i don't know that i would go that far yeah ditto that's how it's spelled yep d-i-t-t-o just ask pokemon zach knows pokemon he gotta know better than that we got travis blackman coming in dropping the like what's up travis how are we doing today <laughs> sir thank you for that like much, much love. Much, much love to everybody in here. Ooh, okay. Got lucky. Got lucky. All right, let's go. Ooh, got lucky again. Super lucky. Oh no, the fireball got me! And the share from Travis. What's up, brother? Thank you so much for the share. Jojo said, shh. <laughs> hey, Jordan, how goes it? Oh, it's going, brother. How goes it your way, my friend? It's going pretty good right now. We're just grinding out some 36 chambers. Uh, we took down Bowser X Machina last week, and so we got a brand new... Uh, gauntlet grind starting this week with 36 chambers until we clear it and if you're wondering why it's called enter the 36 chambers it is because there are 36 chambers 36 rooms that we have to clear uh, closer though my dad had a picture frame of the word that's the only reason I knew how to spell it oh there you go I mean nothing wrong with that Doing good. Hey, glad to hear that, brother. Glad to hear that. So, is everybody ready for Christmas? I keep asking y'all, and nobody ever says they are or they are not. Do you have all your gifts wrapped? I need to know. I know JoJo said they didn't have their gifts wrapped. I need more people to confirm. Do you have your gifts wrapped yet? Are you ready for Christmas? Is the tree even up? Like, let me know. <laughs> let me know. We got the tree up. We've had the tree up all month, of course. Uh, but the gifts are not wrapped. Not wrapped. Okay, so I think if I don't go fast enough, that's why the fireballs are catching up to me. That's what I think is going on there. That's what I think is going on there. Yep, see how easy that is when I go at the right time? Oh, the fireball got me! Man, oh man, so I might want to wait one or two cycles on that because it seems like I keep landing on the fireball or having a fireball pick me off every time I do get the key coin. 
Seems like the fireball is my worst enemy there. I don't really know how I'm going to um, escape that. Don't know how I'm going to escape that fireball hazard. Nope. Bad jump. Rap before my TMNT and no tree. Nope. Still haven't started rapping. Uh, I'm ready for it to be over. Just barely got the tree up. I need to rap still. Took the kids shopping today for their mom. Shopping for my wife is rough. I think everybody has at least one person that shopping for is always difficult every year. At least one person. Um, we try our best to make a board. Like a little whiteboard, dry erase board. With ideas for everybody. But, um... It don't always work out. It don't always work out. This year, I was probably the most difficult one to shop for because I did not know what I wanted. And so I did not give any ideas to anyone. Just kind of a you figure it out scenario. Kind of a you figure it out. Whatever's fine. I think everybody has that one person that's like super difficult to shop for. But yeah, all of our stuff is done. We just got to wrap them. Just got to do some wrapping. That's all that's left to do here. Wrap them the day before, just so they can be torn open the day after. Buzz, buzz. All right, there we go. So that's a good cycle. That's a good cycle. All right, so I'm not sure why that's happening now. I asked for a green screen. Let's go. Let's go. That's a really good ask. I've actually got a really good one. I'm, I'm very pleased with the one I got. Uh, Lauren bought it for me. I believe, if I'm not mistaken. She bought it for me um, for my birthday or, yeah, for my birthday. Very nice green screen. Love the material. Uh, the only thing I would want is it for it to be wider or to have a stand for it. I've got it wall mounted right now. If I had a stand for it and more room in here, then I would definitely uh, move it. But yeah, it's great material. Very, um, very, very, very um, sturdy. Very good green screen. You want a computer. I mean, yeah, but let's be realistic. Let's be realistic here, Travis. Let's be realistic. A computer is expensive. A good one's going to set you back well over $1,500 just for the tower. For a good one. A decent one you can get around $1,500 just for the tower. Then you got to get monitors and all that other good stuff. I don't have a monitor. I'm playing on a TV right now and then I have my laptop screen. So I don't even have a monitor. For the tower, we got Melissa coming in, dropping the like and the share bomb. Welcome in, Ms. Sloth. How are you doing today, Mel? Thank you so much for the like and the share bomb. And we got Ed coming in, dropping the like as well. Professor Sport Mode snuck in. What's going on, Tyler Adam? Thank you so much for the like, my friend. How are you? How are you? Uh, Professor. Professor's been in his lab for days. Uh, Ed said, good evening, what's up, brother? And Travis said, I got the Elgato green screen and love it. Nice, dude, nice. Um, mine is a newer, N-E-E-W-E-R, newer, or newer, however you want to pronounce it. And it's really good quality material. It's a collapsible green screen. So you just pull it and it folds all back up in itself. It's not like a uh, cloth material at all. It is that um, tougher like canvas material, thick. Uh, you can clean it, all that good stuff. One of the uh, other content creators that I was watching at the time actually had this exact same green screen. And he was telling me, but he didn't. I didn't even know that's the green screen he had. I just wanted one kind of like his and I ordered this one. And told him which one I got. And he's like, that is identical to the one I have. Great choice. Especially for the price. Great choice. So I was like, okay. Well, we did good. We did good. 
But I've heard the Elgato green screen is actually really good too. Uh, Melissa said, hi, what's up? What's up, darling? How are you doing? V said, I play on my laptop and TV too. I'd like a monitor. There you go. There you go. Yeah, I would love to get a new computer, but that's just, you know, pricey. That's pricey. Um, Zach said, someone got me a GS. Someone got you a green screen? Nice. I'm doing good, Mel. Doing pretty good. Can't complain. Uh, just dying in Mario's. Just unaliving a lot of toads here today. We're getting, uh, we're getting warmed up. I've been out in the rain all day long. Getting wet, so we're getting warmed up with Mario. Alright, there we go. Get around that. Alright, we're in there. Now we just gotta get in this door without hitting the spike, folks. <laughs> Progress right here. Let's go. Uh, Zach said, I have one. Let's go. Mel says, the correct. Yep, let's go. That's awesome. Uh, Cam said, once I get uh, one, I'm moving my setup upstairs and I'll have my own room for my streams. Let's go, baby. That's what I'm talking about. GG's. Thank you for the progress, Bo. Much love, brother. Much love. Let's go in here. Let's see what's the next room. All right. Well, we got a fire flower. It looks like we got a little coupling action. We got to watch out for the spiny. Yep. I knew that was about to happen. That's all right. Oh, man. Okay, so now we're going to do a jump off of the bullet. Jump off the cannonball to get me up into the door. Okay. Next chamber complete. Uh, who did it? Who did it? Why did it not show? My alert didn't come through there. Hold on, folks. Bo! Okay, so Bo's light came through. Finally, the heart came through, or he hit the like button. Thank you for that. Double, my friend. Much love. Uh, phone autocorrected. It happens. Uh, V said, yes, but I have no money. We'll talk soon. There you go. Alright, well, we're just gonna sacrifice that, because why not? Don't know where I'm going, don't know what I'm doing, don't know what I'm doing, don't know where I'm going. Alright, so apparently I'm supposed to make it over to there. Wonder if I can cheese this. Can't cheese it, folks. Shouldn't have did that. Shouldn't have did that. Okay, well, now we've learned the dance. We have learned the dance. Uh, you can have it and just pay shipping or wait till next month. There you go. There you go. Uh, Bo said, no, I always forget after sending hearts and just start typing, uh, but spammed it after progress. Let's go. Let's go. Thank you for that uh, like spam, brother. And J&J &J Game Stream coming in, dropping that like. Welcome in, J&J. &J. What is up, brother? How are you doing? How are you? How are you? Thank you for that like. Where's your button? There's your button. <laughs> Right, we got a little bit of progress so far, guys. A little bit of progress. See if we can keep going. We did it once. That means we can do it again, right? We did it once. That means we can do it again. Uh, Zach yelling, John, drive by. Alright, just wait for the next cycle because I made a mistake. Mistakes were made. Yep, mistakes were made again. <laughs> John said, it's been a long day driving a shop truck. Mine is in the shop for service. Why do your trucks always go to the shop for service, sir? And there comes Cam dropping the double. Moxin Gaming, what's up, brother? What's up? Thank you for that double. Much, much love and appreciation. How are we? How are we? All right, let's get it, guys. Let's go. We want to get back in there. We want to see some more progress, right? Yeah, everybody wants more progress. That's the name of the game today. Progress. Not clear, but progress. 
Chuck is basically just getting an oil change. Ah, I got you. Okay, well, that's not, uh, not anything major. That's not anything major. Standard service. Slide right into it. And a wash. There you go. Nothing wrong with that. Nothing wrong with that, John. Nothing wrong with that, brother. All right. Can we do this, folks? Can we get back to where we were? Let me out of the tornadoes of doom. No. Uh, if y'all want to see an amazing streamer, just hang out here. He's always redhead and bearded. I need to shave. Uh, and can show you a smile. If just for a while. Eh, sometimes. 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 There's a lot of amazing content creators here, though, guys. A lot of crazy good amazing content creators here. Like, uh, Mr. Cameron there, who just came in with the triple like. R-E-T-V, what's up? Thank you for the triple cam. If y'all haven't checked out, uh, Cam over on R-E-T-V yet, he is doing, uh... The Wednesday mornings, I believe. Wednesday mornings over on RETV. Correct me if I'm wrong, sir. And Mox in Gaming. Uh, doing his normal schedule there. Then we got raided by the Painless Streamer. That's Zachary Payne right there. Amazing, amazing, amazing friend and content creator. We got J&J Game Stream in the house. Always super supportive. Amazing guy right there. Uh, you're welcome, buddy. Hey, much love. We got Mystic Eve Gaming over on the purple side in the house. Always love, always supportive, always here. If you haven't checked her out yet, what are you waiting for? What is your problem? Who else we got here? You're right. Hey, I thought so. I thought so. So, uh, Wednesday mornings, RETV, Ms. Sloth. That's who else we got here. Melissa Mill Gruel. Coming in, dropping those sheer bombs, Ms. Sloth. If I'm not mistaken, I think Ms. Sloth just recently made the change, didn't you? Uh, if you're still here, if you're still here, Mel, I can't English today. I can't English. I believe I saw something about Ms. Sloth moving over to the purple side. I believe I did. And I haven't seen any Ms. Sloth streams here on Facebook. Who else we got in here? Who else we got in here? We got other people in here. Professor Sport Mode was in here. Dude just absolutely smashed R&B Encore. In like two hours. In like two hours. 8092 was in here, man. Dropping some love. 80 absolutely amazing content creator. Love that dude to death. So many great content creators here, man. Uh, Penguin was in here for a little bit. Super, super amazing content creator right here on Facebook. Um, yeah, that's pretty much everybody who's been in here now. So if you want to see some awesome content creators, guys, check all of them out. I just play video games. That's all I do. I just play video games. I'm nobody special. I play video games. I'm, I'm pulling a Zach right now. I just play video games and help other people out. <laughs> I know the feeling. False information. Y'all are great. I just turn on the camera. See? See, I'm pulling a Zach right now. I just turn on the camera and play video games. Go check them out. Watch them. They're amazing. Uh, whatever. Oh, whatever. Uh, what did V say? Cam's amazing. Zach's great. I'm terrible. <laughs> I'm deleting that comment right now. No, I'm not going to delete it. <laughs> You're right. Uh, so my sister asked a question on Monday. Do I even want to know? Do I even want to know? Like, seriously, do I, do I even want to ask what she asked? Yep, that's how I feel. Well, see, that's the thing. It doesn't matter how you feel. It matters how you make other people feel. And you make other people feel amazing. Both of you. So, stop it. Just stop it. Just accept our love. 
Uh, Cam said I actually rated Professor Sport Mode after my RATV this morning. Nice, bro. Nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Not surprising. Not surprising. Not surprising. I'd be more surprised if we could go a week without someone asking us one of those two questions. One week. One a week. Without someone asking. When are y'all gonna get married? When are y'all gonna have babies? One week. I would be more surprised. Far more surprised. Uh, I think I'm a trucker with a Mario addiction. Uh, you might be a Mario addict with a trucking addiction. You might be a Mario addict with a trucking addiction. Or you might be a Mario with a truck addiction. Yeah. You ever think about it that way, John? Bad habits from Zach. Oh, there are so many. Alright, well, this is just a terrible cycle. I think I'm gonna try and reset. And try and reset it. Can I reset it? That's the real question. Oh, I think I can actually reset it. I couldn't quite get there. Uh, I can agree with this statement. Yes. Yes. 100%. 100,000%. Alright, we gotta get all the coins in this level too, guys. That's the uh, clear condition. All the coins. Oof. Been a few weeks since your interview with Kim since it was brought up. Uh, nope. 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 That is not the last time it was brought up to me. <laughs> not the last time it was brought up to me. I just don't mention it every time somebody mentions it to me. I don't sit there and say, oh, guess what? So-and-so told me today or asked me today. I just don't mention it. Because I'm tired of hearing it. Tired of hearing it. I'm going to start telling people when they, uh, when they decide they're going to pay for it, they can, uh, they can have an opinion about it. When they fully fund either the marriage or the 18 years of raising a child, when they fully fund that, they can have an opinion on it. Until then, they get no say. Alright, let's go get up here. Almost. Yikes. Come on, bro. Stop spitting them at me. Oh, that would have been it. I missed it. Okay, sending a check, Zach said. <laughs> you do whatever makes uh, make y'all happy. That's what matters. Exactly. Exactly. That's my point. That's my point. Uh, yep. Well, Zach's sending a check, so, uh, there you go. So they're almost perfectly in sync. Almost perfectly in sync. Oh. 
All right, now I just gotta get back, back the other way. Oh, it's a little bit too late there. This is tough, man. This is really tough. We've made it past that once. We're getting it down a little bit better, but gotta get that uh, bounce back. Gotta get that bounce back. Uh, thing is, I'm not a patient person. Well, I mean, you've been patient for six years, ain't you? Been patient for six years. Sounds like pretty patient to me. Barely missed that fireball. Oh, come on. Trish did too. There you go. There you go. There you go. Excuse me. Oh, too close. Too close. Alright, we're getting there. We are getting there, guys. Slowly but surely, we're making baby progress. Baby steps along the way. There we go, okay. Now I just gotta wait to get back in. No! Bad jump, you can do it! I'm doing my best. Doing my best. We got back across, we just gotta get back up top into the door. Getting super close. Super close. Super close. Like how that works sometimes and then other times it just drags me into that spike and there's nothing I can do about it. I don't like how that happens. Like sometimes it works super good and I'm just like then other times it does not. Wow. Okay. First time I uh Got hit by that one falling like that. I've jumped into it a few times, but that was a first. All right, we're in and we're out. So I like this little wait strategy. Just wait and go. Works pretty well, I think. Alright, they're lined up perfectly.
Nope. Take my time. There we go. Okay, now I just gotta get in that door. Oh, <laughs> too much. Too much. Hit the spike before we could land. That was close. That was close. Baby steps in progress. We're getting there. We are getting there. Oh, squished. So close. Yeah, it was close. It was close. We're getting there. We'll be getting that part down in no time. We'll be uh, moving right on along to the rest of the level in no time. See what I'm talking about? Sometimes it works. Sometimes I just get drug the other direction. Not sure why it does that. Not sure at all why it does that. All right, we're gonna wait for it to completely land like that. That lines them up perfectly. Now we're just going to get in the door. There we go. We're in the door. Fire flower. <sighs> Why me? That's all right. I wanted to keep the fire flower, but that's all right. Again, that's all right. I would have took a hit here anyway, probably. Uh, we have learned now to hit the P-switch. But what we didn't learn was to bring momentum. Let's go. Thank you for the progress. Woo! Getting good at that part. Yeah, that part is actually the part that's going to slow me down the most. Getting it every time. If I can get to where I'm getting that every time that I get to it, then uh, we'll start making some real progress very soon. Thank you for the progress, JoJo. Because the more I'm able to get past that part consistently, the more that I can get down the rest of the uh, rooms after. And then it's just a matter of figuring each new room out until we get to another tough one. Like that there. I don't like that part. Getting that down consistently is also something I've got to figure out. Because right now, that's not consistent either. Bo said, yeet the let out frustration. Let's go. All right. We're going to get out our Yoshi for Bo. He needs some frustration releases. So let's get the Yoshi out. Let's give him a yeet. And there he goes. Falling to the ground. In typical Yoshi fashion. Doing what Yoshi does best. There's a nice, perfectly good platform over here for him to land on. And he chose to go to the pit. He chose to fall. Because that's what Yoshis do. All right, here we go, 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 Vogue's, wait till it touches, and boom, they're almost perfect. Oh, not momentum, I gotta get more momentum. That was a nice cycle, but did not have the momentum for it. Not enough momentum. 
That jump right there is so tough. You have to jump right here where this long block is. That's where you have to jump at. That's where you have to jump in order to get up there. If you're wondering and playing and trying to figure out why can't I get up there? It's that one block. You aim for that block and you jump. If you're a little bit too low, you won't make it. If you're a little bit too high, you hit the spike. All right, get me out of the tornadoes of doom. Let's go. That's a good cycle. Oh no! I was pressing up and accidentally hit left a little bit too much. I was trying to press up to get in the door. Trying to press up to get in that door and it did not work. Alright. Just gonna wait for the next cycle. I didn't trust that fireball being there. Beautiful, yeah, now that's getting really nice and clean. There we go, okay, so that's getting really nice. There we go, beautiful, okay, save the fire flower this time. Means I have an additional hit I can take here. Get the coin and just reset the room. Why not? That makes a lot more sense than taking the hit, right? Doesn't that make a lot more sense than taking the hit? I thought so too. Alright, well, looks like we got to get over here to get a coin. And then we got to get past this hammer, bro. Oh, okay. Not a problem. Not a problem. Progress. Oh, no. Oh, man. So, it looks like we have to bring... We have to bring a power-up in that room. It looks like we have to bring a power-up to there. That is progress. Thank you for the progress, Bo. Looks like we have to bring a power-up there because we're going to take a hit there. We are going to take a hit there 100% of the time. No ifs, ands, or buts about it. We are going to take a hit there, jumping off them donuts to that middle section 100% of the time. That means we have to get there with a power-up. That's rough. That's rough. It's not too bad, but that's kind of... Kind of harsh. The penalty for losing the power-up is you cannot make progress. Bad jump. Bad, bad jump there. Not that I've seen any way, anyway. I don't see any other way to make that jump to those upper... Donuts because you cannot um, Cannot control jump off a donut to my knowledge To my knowledge you cannot control jump off a donut It's just a full bounce
All right. We be in there. All right, well, we got to keep this power up. Ain't keeping no power ups, okay. Okay, well, maybe we can get back there and at least test my theory. Maybe we can get back there and at least test my theory. Nice! Let's see if we can at least test my theory out. You are 100% of the time going to take a hit. going to be harder to get past that uh, hammer bro now, too. be much harder to get past this hammer bro without taking a hit. A nice little hidden power up would be good there. Yep. <laughs> I had a feeling I was going to take a hammer to the foot. Not a problem. Not a problem. Still good progress. We made it right back there. Super quick. So that's great. That's great. If I can keep making it back there, we will get it figured out and get it cleared quick. Or at least get that section cleared, I should say. Beautiful. Love it when a plan comes together. Emotional damage. Hooey. Oh, I bounced right off of it. The fireballs, man. Big ouch. Progress getting better. Just gotta take your time on that hammer. Yep, yep, absolutely. Hopefully I can get there again with a uh, fire flower take my time take him out I really don't even have to take him out I would love to get there with the power up I need a power up of some sort I feel like uh, some type of power up would be great uh, what's the spikes that come down this and, uh, and and squash me those are icicles those are icicles Those are falling icicles, sir. Welcome in, Jim. How are you doing today, bud? Thank you for that. Uh, thank you for that light. We got Ken Reeves coming in, dropping the like. What's up, Brad man? Ken, how you doing, brother? What's up, what's up, what's up? Yikes. Not the ice. <laughs> Uh, you talking about the giant mashers? Talking about the giant mashers? Doing good, hey. Glad to hear it, Jim. Glad to hear it. Yep, old Ken. Dropping in. Giving the old thumbs up a Rooney. Ken approves of this message. That's what he's letting me know. Ken approves of this Mario gameplay. Man, come on. Yeah, yeah, so those are, um... Uh, I forget what they're called, actually. I just call them the Giant Mashers, but, uh... They have an actual name. I forget what they're called, though. Yeah, those aren't any problem, though. Those, those aren't an issue at all. They're all just about timing, being patient, waiting, and then going when necessary. Oof. Barely got that. Ugh. Whew. All right. In there. All right. This is what I need to do better at. Uh, 
I'm not getting hit by this guy. All right, we got the fire flower. Got the fire flower in here. Reset the room. Alright, we're good to go. You talking about these giant things? Come about those? Yeah, I just call them the mashers. I forget what they're actually called. They're called something. Crud. Alright. Well, we're about to find out right now, folks. Can I make it past this without... Yeah, see, it's full jump or nothing. It's full jump or nothing here. Full jump or nothing. So there's no way for me to make, I don't think, it over there at all without a power-up. I think it's... I think it's a, uh, you need a D-booster. Spike pillars. It's not what they're actually called. I said, I forget what they're actually called. They have an actual name. But I just forget what they're called. And they might even be called mashers. I don't know. Uh, it's been so long since I've built a level. Been so long since I've actually built ice spikes. Not the ice spikes. He's talking about the giant columns that come down. Uh, these are the spikes. The, the icicles. Those are icicles. I know what those are called. Uh, we got Mace coming in, dropping that like. What's up, Mace? Sorry, still on the last conversation. Now you're giver. <laughs> you're totally good. Well, welcome in, Mace. How are you doing, brother? Thank you for the like. How did your darts go last night, sir? How did darts go last night? How did darts go? Let me know. Did you win? Did you have fun? Did you at least do good? Those big pillars are spike pillars. That's what Mario Maker says. No, it's not. You're gonna make me open up creator. You're gonna make me open up creator mode. You're gonna make me open up creator mode just to see if it says spike pillars because I'm like 99% positive that it doesn't. Yikes. Dun -uh. All right, we're gonna find out here shortly what they're called. I'm gonna take one of them to the face. Uh, had a good night, shot well, and left early. Had uh, three one eighties. Nice, GGs, GGs. That's awesome. I like the plants with the wings. Yeah, the piranha plants with the wings. Yep. They're pretty cool, man. I love all the different stuff that you can do on this game. Make a level interesting. Alright, come on. There we go. Let's get in the door. 
All right, there we go. John coming in, dropping the double. Thank you for the double, John Hullinger. There goes my power up. There goes Spike Pillar. Skewer. Thank you. Skewer. That's what they call him. Skewer. Skewer. That's the word. Not Spike Pillars. The word that Mario Maker 2 refers to them as in the creator when you are creating is a skewer. Just had a traumatic experience. Oh no. Oh no. I'm doing pretty good, Mace. Cannot complain. Uh, just doing my best to beat this level. Not doing too well at it, but you know. <laughs> I uh, just got time for a quick hello. Not a problem. I appreciate the quick hello. Uh, working at the night shift. All right, brother. Well, don't work too hard. Mario Maker calls Spike Pillar. Mario World calls them Spike Pillar. Maker calls them Skewers. Yeah, yeah, they're Skewers. There we go. Okay, finally got it. Said it before I could say it. There you go. Yeah, I knew I knew that they weren't called spike pillars in Mario Maker. Which I term everything after Mario Maker because it's the first game that I have been able to play that I was able to create a game and create a level. And so whatever Mario Maker calls it, that's what I call it. Um, I don't know if they would call it, they would, might call it different in Lunar Magic when you're creating a ROM hack. They might call them Spike Pillars. Don't know. But I know in Mario Maker, they are skewers. So that's what I'm going to forever know them as. All right, let's just get on over here. Can we take a moment to uh, appreciate the fact that I bonked and threw myself in lava? <laughs> I just totally bonked and threw myself into the lava pit. I jumped early. I like the timing. I like the timing. I like it when they line up perfectly. I like it when they line up perfectly. Yikes, went too far left. Uh, I was washing my hands and what I thought was a woman walking in the bathroom, I thought for sure I was in the wrong place. Guess not. Yep, yep, yep. I mean, you never know anymore. You never know. Never know anymore. <laughs> Come on, bro. I don't like that part. I don't like that part at all. I'm not a fan of the uh, tornadoes, the twisters as they're called, the blowy joeys, whatever you want to call them. I'm not a fan of the twisters. And uh, yeah, definitely not a fan of that usage of them. Ooh, first time I got hit by that. I uh, checked the sign on the way out, making sure I didn't make a mistake, right? <laughs> I hear you. I always double check before I go in. I'm like, okay, men's? Yeah, men's? Okay. And sometimes I even check when I walk out, and I'm like, I did go in the men's, right? And just to make sure... Oh, I thought I was going to hit that fireball for sure. Come on, bro. Stop it. 
Why? Why? All right, here we go again. Here we go again. Same old Mario, just another day. Here we go again. You know how Toad Spin jumps on the piranha plant with wings. Here we go again. Piranha plants gotta do what piranha plants gotta do. Here we go again. So if I beat this level, I'm gonna scream woohoo! Maybe. Wahoo! Okay, let's go. Get him. There we go. Alright. Reset the room. Now let's see if we can get back to the hammer bro with the fire flower. If we can get back to the hammer bro, period. That'd be nice. Alright, there's the hammer bro. First, we gotta go past the skewers. The skewers. Alright, we got the key though. Haha, <laughs> we kept it! Alright, let's go, guys. Let's go. How am I supposed to do that? I gotta keep both up. How? There's no way, bro. How? How am I supposed to do that? How am I supposed to do that? That's what I want to know. Just normal bouncing without holding jump, I was hitting the spikes up top. How am I supposed to do that? What in the world is this? Yeah, how am I supposed to do that? There's no way. There is no way possible. No way possible. I was just normal bouncing on him and got and lost my mushroom. So normal bouncing on them loses your mushroom. You gotta take a power up in there. Do I just have to beat it? Like, damage boost both of them? In the middle of the donuts? Well, the middle of the donuts is the highest point. But see, the issue comes from, depending on where you hit the donut, depending on where you hit the donut, it bounces you a certain direction. So if you hit the sides of the donut, like the upper sides of the donut, it's going to bounce you that direction. And if you don't hold jump, you're not going to make it back to the donut. So if you don't hit dead center of them, then you're probably going to bounce off into the lava. From the first one. After the first one... You could technically hit the center, like, between the two of them, but you have no idea which way you're going to go. Between, yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I could, pr I could possibly go between them there, but even then, I don't know which way it's going to push me. And trying to control the bounce on a, on a donut block like that, that's hard. That is super hard to, uh, to do. I don't know if there's any way to actually get past that without just hitting dead center of the um, donuts 
perfectly and being small. I think that is literally meant for you to be small and hit the dead center of them just perfectly and not all jump. But I feel like I hit dead center and lost my mushroom, which tells me you can't have a power up on that part. Can't have a power up on that part. We got to have a power up to get to it. Can't have a power up on it, but gotta get a gotta have a power up to get to it. Wowza! Wowza! Yeah, I don't know about that. I don't know about that room. That room is going to be a. Uh, a definite learning experience for me. I don't understand how I can possibly do that room. Miss the jump, 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 I miss the jump. I don't know. I'm at a loss for that love for that uh that room. That chamber is beyond anything I've ever seen before. kidding me well there goes fire flower that little step down throws the rhythm off just enough to where if you don't re grab your uh, jump button just right you're not gonna make it or your jump button not run button all right Well, rip. We got Professor Sport Mode coming in, dropping that like. Welcome in, Professor. How many chambers have I made it to to this one? I don't understand this. I don't understand this right here. How am I supposed to get there? How am I supposed to get there without a power-up? I don't think it's possible to get there without a power-up. Okay, so it is possible. It is possible, and apparently this is perfect for small toad. Apparently this is just perfect for small toad. What is this nonsense? You got it. Don't hold jump land on him. Yeah, well, I, I went in there big. And I didn't hold jump and it took my power up away. And then I, I, I kind of panicked and I was like, okay, we'll just damage boost through. 
and uh, I took one too many hits, so I didn't think it was actually possible to get up there without the power-up. I see how to get up there without the power-up now, but that's rough. That's rough. That is rough. I'm guessing I could probably shortcut down by riding the icicle down, but I'm intended to go across. But I don't know that shortcutting down is the right call because if there's a coin across there, then I can't beat the level. So I need to see the right side. Uh, poor professor is feeling left out. What do you mean he's feeling left out? He was in here earlier and already played his song or played his uh, button. Uh, it's all about landing on the right side with rightward momentum to make the gap. Yeah. Just like to jump over there to the top. Um, I just didn't think it was possible to do without a damage boost. Apparently it is. Apparently it is possible to do without a damage boost. Yeah, Professor came in earlier. And I played his button earlier. He just now came in with the double though. Just now coming in with the double like. So thank you for that double like, Professor. Much love, brother. And how are you doing today? Never made the icicle, but coin is on the right. Okay, I didn't forget his button. I played it way earlier. I played it um nearly an hour ago. When he came in and liked with his main profile. Uh, but yeah, I figured, I figured, you know, you could probably make the uh, icicle to get down to the door. But being that it's a coin clear condition, there'd be a coin over there to stop that cheese. So I kind of already figured on that. Definitely need to go to the right side. But that's the furthest that I've been so far. Like, I'm... I'm Pretty excited that I got that far. Last time I was struggling really bad uh, just to get out of the uh, piranha plants. And we figured that down pretty good. Got it down pretty decently. Like, I don't get it every time I get there, but I am definitely feeling it a lot uh, more rhythmatic than I did last time I played it. This part right here. I feel a lot better about this than I did last time. So that's a good thing. Too fast, too furious. Um, if you duck the whole time in the donut section, you can keep the power up, but not being small leads to issues in the following rooms. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Makes sense. Makes sense. It definitely looks like a... You're intended to lose the power up here if you have one. So, um, don't cheese it type situation. <laughs> Definitely looks like that. Like I said, I went in and I jumped it and it, uh, it just took that mushroom away. And then I must have been panic jumping. Are we going to wait next cycle? I'm going to wait till the next cycle. I like to hit this right there. Close. Close enough. There we go. All right, we're in there. Whatever. Team don't need it. Go hit him. Whatever. Team don't need it, right? Whatever. Um, I have this level, your five minute cape speed run, and mocking a prime to finish up now that I'm done with RMB. Let's go, let's go. My five minute cape speed run? What are you talking about five minute cape speed run? There's no such thing. <laughs> There's no such thing, sir. Five minute cape speed run. Who would do such a thing? Who would do such a thing? Not me. Not me, sir.
Yeah, yeah, I know. Five minute cape speed run, yes. It's an obstacle course, sir. <laughs> Not a speed run. You just have to go fast enough to complete the obstacle course. Oh no, I didn't delete it. Oh no, it's still there. And last I checked, it's unbeaten too. Last time I checked, it's still uncleared. Nope, I'm going to leave it up. It took way too much time for me to beat it, for me to, to delete it. <laughs> it took way too much time for me to beat that bad boy, for me to delete it. It will stay up indefinitely. Boom, boom, right there. Uh, one of these days, one of these days, I am going to get my button inputs right. Wee! Yeah, it's still there. Question is, are you feeling lighter than a feather? Are you feeling lighter than a feather? That's the real question. Said solid. We'll see how long it takes. I don't have too many streams left before I go on break. Let's go. Let's go. Uh, depending on how long you're streaming for, um, I don't know that I would look to beat it in one stream. Just saying. Like, I have been very close to beating it in just like a few runs. But all it takes is one slip up in any room, like one too many errors, because it's not a perfect, you know, it's not, it's not, you, you don't have to be absolutely perfect, but there are minimal opportunities for mistakes, very minimal. You can only make very few mistakes, and in certain rooms, if you make a mistake, it's much more costly than in other, than in other rooms. And you want to save your mistakes for specific rooms. So, uh, for instance, um, the 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 slow climb, the slow bounce up. You want to save your mistakes for that room, one of them. The third room where you're bouncing on all the donuts up and over. You want to, you know, save your mistakes for that room. Those two rooms in particular are where you want to use up your three, four, whatever mistakes you get. You don't want to use them up before that. You don't want to use them up in other rooms. And if you use a mistake in those rooms, you can't use too many in the others. Because you do get a couple mistakes. Nobody's ever going to clear that with a perfect run. I, I haven't even done that. I've gotten close to a perfect run, and then I always get a mistake in the slow bounce room. Um, will it remain uncleared for all of eternity? It very well might. <laughs> I'll be honest with you, it very well might. <laughs> Professor said, not as long as I live. I mean, Professor, I think, probably has a pretty good shot at clearing it. Don't get me wrong. Put in the time, put in the grind. That man is an absolute beast. Um, he could do it. But that level, like I said, you, you, you will think you're on the perfect pace. You've got it beat, and then... You'll have one too many mistakes in one room, and you won't quite make it to the to the GG. You'll be 15, 20 seconds short, 10 seconds short. I have literally ran out of time touching the goal before because I had one too many mistakes in one prior room. So it's not it's not about being perfect. It's just about um, being good enough. You just gotta be good enough. And be willing to grind it enough to uh, get fast enough. How do I keep doing that, man? I think anybody could beat it given enough, uh, given give, given enough practice at it, and given it enough grinding because it's definitely one of them levels you got to grind bro you're gonna grind it you ain't just gonna hop in there i don't care how good your cape skills are your name can be eric busby 
the best cape master that I know of. And you ain't gonna jump in there and just clear that thing. I don't care. Them, them tricks are just, some of them are just far too awkward. It's stuff that you don't see all the time. And even if you are used to doing stuff similar to it, try doing it in that level. It don't play the same. It don't feel the same. <laughs> like it's not what you think it is. I think I just want to take the hit. Professor said take the hit. Oh, I over jumped it. Well, that was progress. That was progress. We made progress, folks. We got almost to that door. But yeah, that level, um, whoever made it should not have. I'll tell you that now. Whoever made it should have just left the easier version and not uploaded the hard version. So that was just mean of them. <laughs> very mean of them. <laughs> just saying. Very, very mean of them. Whoever did that. I don't know who did it. Wasn't me. I would never do such a thing. I mean, just a moment. Emotional damage. Yikes. Yep, there's the ouch right there. Welcome in, Fest. Thank you so much for the <laughs> like and the yeet. That means we're going to get our Yoshi out just for you, Fest. And we're going to give him a good old-fashioned yeet. There he goes, flying. I caught him this time, though. She's not going to the ground. I plan on using the easy version as practice. But you could have given us 500 seconds instead of 300. Look. Listen here, sir. Originally, I did. Okay. Originally, I did give 500 seconds instead of 300. Do you want to know why I didn't give 500 seconds in the final version? Because it was too easy. It's not a hard version if it's too easy. It's not a hard version if I beat it every time I play it. Like, literally, with 500 seconds on the clock, it's just as easy as the easy version. The only difference is, you ain't got no checkpoints. That, that would lit literally have been the only difference. Instead of a checkpoint, you got clear condition. So you gotta beat it from start to finish. I was doing that, no problem. I was doing that, no problem, if I had enough time. The time constraint is what makes that level difficult. The time constraint is what makes it harder. Because it's the exact same level. Everything is the same. So with max time, I am in no rush to get to the goal. I've got 50 to 100 mistakes. I can make 50 to 100 mistakes in that level and still get the clear. Versus with a 300 second timer, you get like 5 mistakes tops depending on where you take them makes a huge difference you still get a little bit of wiggle room for error not much you got to be good you got to get good that's why i dropped it down to 300 and before i uploaded it i was about to uh move it to 400 because i couldn't beat it <laughs> too easy for you it bro it was honestly it was too easy for me i went to upload it just said it wasn't a speed run. It's not a speed run. TikTok, Instagram. Uh, yeah, no, it, I mean, it's not a speed run. It is not a speed run. 100% not a speed run, my friend. There are no hints here, sir. Um, it is an obstacle course with a time limit. It's an obstacle course with a time limit. You have to beat the time limit. And clear all the obstacles to pass. But, yeah, I mean, it, it was literally, I played through the easy mode, and then with the hard mode, I one-shot it. I was literally one-shotting the hard mode with 500 seconds. And that's that doesn't scream hard to me. I was having just as much difficulty with the easy mode as I was with the hard mode. 
And so if it doesn't feel any less difficult or any more difficult to me, that's not a hard mode, in my opinion. I wanted a definite distinction between the two. The timer being the distinction, making it super, super, super difficult in comparison. I gave a huge one at the end of the stream today. There you go. Yeah. Not on Facebook. <laughs> Not on Facebook. But yeah, I mean... It do be what it do be. I think Professor has the uh, skills to get it. I think he has the skills to get it if he has the time to get it. That's the biggest thing. And the same with anybody else. If, if, you, if you're decent with Cape, I think you've got the skills to get it if you have the time to get it. If you have the time to grind it out, you can definitely, def definitely, definitely get it. But that level is grindy. It's one of those where you think you've got it beat. You're going to be short by 10 seconds. You better be pretty close to perfect. Four to five mistakes, not huge ones either. Minimal mistakes. They better not be like super costly mistakes. Like failing that climb, that slow climb, you can fail that like four times if that's your only mistake. Four or five times if that's your only mistake and still clear the level. But you're going to be tight on time. You said Doobie. Don't argue with Redhead. He's from Georgia, so he's correct. <laughs> that is not true, sir. That's not true. Uh, yes, I did say Doobie. I was told on Friday that the Honda place was shut down at 10.30 p.m. And if you're not there by then, you have to wait at the truck stop until January 3rd. Well, I already know that's not going to happen. Yikes. What you mean to say, Fess, was... I go dogs. I go dogs. I go dogs. And welcome in, James Stewart. How are you doing today, brother? Thank you for that like. What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up? What he meant to say was a Banzac, a Banzac, a Banzac. <laughs> we don't roll no tide around these parts, folks. Come on. Come on. 36 chambers. Let's go. What's up? What's up? Yes, sir. We have entered the 36 chambers. We have not gotten to the 36th chamber by any means. We're struggling. We are struggling on certain parts. But we're making progress, slowly but surely. Uh, Georgia isn't all it's cracked up to be. Here their college team is about to lose uh, at the end of the month. Yeah, I mean, Georgia Tech probably will lose at the end of the month. Oh, wait, they're not even playing again. Never mind. <laughs> Uh, uh, oh man uh, yeah Georgia Tech always loses you're right where's the band button redhead saying blasphemy <laughs> uh, lies I would never say no such thing never say no such thing so double negative you would say such a thing you would say such a thing sir Let me get past this and I'll catch up some more. Go, 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 go. Come on, come on, come on, come on. All right. Uh, if somebody really thinks I'm going to wait in a truck, stop from Friday, December 23rd to January 3rd, and they are smoking something and I want it. I don't know about Georgia Tech, but go dogs. Go dogs, go dogs, go dogs. We all know Bo secretly wants the dogs to beat his team because he don't want no more of that uh, Michigan smoke. He don't want to get beat by Michigan again. Two times in one year? Oh no. Can't have that. The shame on his family would be immense. He would never live it down. <laughs> he would have to change his colors. 
he would have to change his official team and start supporting Michigan because they would be the superior team. And he would know it. And he would have no choice but to accept it. <laughs> uh, Fist said, I'm from Georgia. The more negatives in a sentence means most is negative, right? <laughs> uh, those are fighting words, bro. Well, I mean, you know it. You know it. <laughs> Where I come from, you down talk my dogs and them is fighting words too. Don't you forget that. <laughs> this room right here, I don't like it at all. 100% hate that room. That's the room I'm stuck on. Gator roll! Gator roll! <laughs> Death roll! <laughs> you forgot the word tide. Gator roll tide! <laughs> uh, roll tide roll get it roll get it roll tide roll tide get it tide <laughs> oh well that's not good I missed that one uh hail to the victors valiant hail hail to Michigan the champions of Ohio State yeah John's real happy about that we already beat LSU sir we already beat them we already beat them that's why there's a nice little SEC championship sh uh, shirt there in the room as a Christmas gift this year. See, I'm able to give away championship shirts for Christmas gifts. What about you guys? What about you? What about you guys? Can you give away a uh, Big Ten championship shirt this year for a Christmas gift, Bo? <laughs> I didn't think so. <laughs> I'm giving away SEC championship and Natty championship shirts this year, boys. We gave away Natty shirts last year, too. Oh, it's going to be nice to give back-to-back -back championship shirts like that. So sweet. Boy, getting good at this. If he could stop running into the spikes. <laughs> he can't, but I could. <laughs> there you go, John. There you go. Uh, I can give away two parts. All I need is a coffee can. I couldn't read all the way through. Sorry. And oh, God, they won three times in the last decade. Can't be great every year. <laughs> That's true. That's true. That is true. Fair enough. Fair enough. But you know who can be great every year? Go dogs! Go dogs! Go dogs! Go dogs! Go dogs! Sick them! Sick them, boys! Sick them! Sick them! Sick him, boys. Sick him. Go. All right. He says he's just kidding, but he's not. Don't let him fool you. John's about that life. He wants all the smoke. <laughs> he wants all that smoke. He's a Spartan alumna. Can't even spell alumni. I can't even spell alumni. What's an alumni? What's an alumina? Alumina? Is that like part of the Illuminati? Alumni? If you got alumni, you might want to call a doctor. Oh wait, that's a bumni. My bad. Brandon coming in, dropping that heart reaction. What's up, nephew? Thank you for the heart. What's up, what's up, what's up? How you doing today? How are you, kiddo? You made it just in time to watch me fall in some more lava. Oh, no lava this time. All right, not yet. No lava just yet. We gotta wait till the next room. I think you meant a lump in your knee. Yeah, yeah. If you got a lump in your knee, then you need to call a doctor. 
Doctor, doctor, give him the news. He's got a bad case of being a fan of a team that's gonna lose. Woo, baby. All right, that's all right. Don't want it. Ouch. Ouch. That was not good. That was not good. It was so bad. All right, let's go. Let's get it. Uh, so much hate. Yeah. <laughs> you know it. This is what happens when people start talk talking like trash about my dogs. Okay, this is what happens. All the hate comes out. Let the hate flow through you. Yes, yes. <laughs> you don't know the power of the dark side. I can't do James Earl Jones. Sorry, it's not happening. <laughs> and my throat's getting sore. From all this talking and I'm gonna blame it on working outside in the rain when it's cold every day for the past two weeks that's what I'm gonna blame it on but I know it's just literally me talking way too much uh, hi dilly ho Rio yeah I almost actually played um, R&B Encore tonight I almost played R&B Encore tonight I thought about it but I was like, no, I've had 36 chambers in the bank pocket for months and months and months now. We need to get in here and work on it. We need to get in here and work on some 36 chambers. Gots to get it done. I know I saw him. Just give me a moment and we'll get to him. There they go. Jose Rodriguez coming in, dropping the like and the 50 stars. What's up, Jose? <laughs> Thank you so much for the like. Thank you so much for those 50 stars, brother. How are you doing today? Much, 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 much love. Let's celebrate those 50 stars. Jose, Jose Rod, this one's for you, brother. said how are you gonna feel when the b1g fails big and tcu goes on to win the natty i don't know what the b1g is but we're part of the sec the georgia bulldogs s e c and we don't fail sir nobody stands a chance but us been saying that all year long well i mean not only do we stand a chance, we're going to win. We're going to win. There's like no doubt. There's no question about it. Go ahead and place your safe bets now, folks. We are winners. That's what we do. It's in our blood. We're thorough thoroughbred winners. Besides, who's TCU anyway? <laughs> never even heard of them. How can I lose to a team I've never even heard of? Need to talk to you after stream. The Big Ten? Oh, well, when the Big Ten fails big, I mean, that's no big sweat off my back because we're SEC, sir. We're not Big Ten, we're SEC. Um, well, 
Mistakes were made. Doing well over the halfway point of the work week. I'm doing good too, Jose. Doing good. Stephanie Wright making an appearance. Welcome in, Sona Fortune Gaming. How are you doing today? Those are Game Boy games, baby. Game Boy? Yeah. I'm a Game Boy. She said, go red, go. Let's go. Good grief. Bingo. Accident here at the Ohio-Indiana border. Yikes. Horn frogs. Never heard of them. Never heard of them. Is that even a real animal? Is that even a real animal, sir? Or horn? Do horned frogs really exist? Do horned frogs even exist? Uh, o h i o. I'm glad to know y'all can spell. At least y'all can spell. Might not be able to win a natty, but at least you can spell. That's a good thing. <laughs> Literally the only good team in the SEC. I mean, that's not true. That's not true. Georgia is not the only good team in the SEC. We were just the best team in the SEC. Maybe I wouldn't want to be the one to find out. <laughs> let's go all right guys that's gonna do it for me tonight we have reached our end time thank you all so much for coming and hanging out chit chatting some football with me doing a little trash talk love it love it love it guys we're gonna find somebody to read over to so hang tight for just a second if you wouldn't mind i would greatly appreciate that you'll want to raid with me uh we will be back tomorrow um throwback thursday i think we're gonna do some more mega man we're gonna try out that mega man game a little bit more have a little bit of fun with it uh who we got on right now who we got on right now a bunch of people i don't know um we got one person i do know though and that's double o badger and he's playing fortnite y'all double o badger playing fortnite what when does that happen never Let's go show Dylan some love, man. Show Badger some love. Tell him Redhead Raid in the chat. Great, great stream, guys. Have a phenomenal night. Much, much love to everybody who came and hung out tonight. Show Badger love. Tell him Redhead Raid. He might even have open lobby. I'm sure he probably does have some room for people. But, uh, yeah. We'll be back tomorrow doing our thing with some Mega Man. And hopefully we'll see you all then. Have a great night, everybody.